Hello everyone. Uh, let's uh, take a look at a couple of trades I made in gold uh, today. So GC. Today is uh, uh, December 29th. Uh, it is a uh, Wednesday, um, so middle of the week. And uh, these are the trades for uh, gold. Uh, in gold, I actually made a $320 profit total minus commissions right um so you see in the in the left side of the chart you do have the 30 minutes uh, which is the anchor chart or the higher time frame um and um and in here you see uh, maybe i can i'm gonna change this um this uh f from from five days to maybe ten days. Okay, so you see that um, uh, gold has been moving uh, to the upside here, then retraced, and today made a, another retracement, probably a second leg. Excuse me. <coughs> okay, I'm dealing with a little bit of flu. So. Um, um so then uh came came back to this uh, area here now pointing bearish uh, all the moving averages are stuck into the downside and then it make a, a move to the downside and then uh, this was overnight at 7 30 i saw this this and um and uh, you know it it was looking bearish um just because uh, we were uh down here below the moving averages but we were overextended already so um, then we retraced and uh, and then uh, by uh, 1 p.m. Uh, gold didn't do anything until the end of the day so we are below the uh, Ichimoku cloud um, we are above so it's a really mixed but I think that uh, with this v-shape we have good possibility to start uh, moving to the upside now so um let me uh open the uh the entry chart uh this one is a wrinkle um so let me show you what uh, the trades were so we were kind of uh, overnight we were moving uh, down uh by 7 a.m um i was actually looking at this and I didn't enter in, 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 entered anything. It was kind of like probably a mistake. Well, it was a mistake, but uh, but I didn't uh, um, I didn't enter it. Uh, so then at 8:16, uh, uh, did, did this pivot and then went to the upside and then um, uh, tried to break uh, that that to the upside. So I took that entry. Um, if you see the conditions were okay to take it um, so if you uh, let me let me paint let me put this um, this vertical line here so we can see what's going on uh, so in here in that uh, brick right after this one I made the entry right there um, so um, you see back, back down below we do have um a momentum uh, to the upside momentum to the upside here just recently made a um a a touch to the uh, zero line and then uh, tried to go up but it failed so it went it so it came back so i immediately sold it right in the third candle so um actually when this one closed then i sold uh, this one it was a hundred and and uh, eighty dollars in three contracts, so sixty dollars per contract loss. Then uh, it broke this one here. Probably I'm taking too many breaks and uh, not that many weeks. So we will see that uh, that one happening in 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 the in the rest of the trades. So here it broke again. This pivot low. Uh, it broke and I took this one and this one was uh, good for $210 so uh, two contracts uh, sold right here at this level and then when it came back at the first uh, green candle or green um, um, 
a green uh, brick, I sold that one. So that one was $110, uh, $210. Then, um, so in between the, these two of, of them, uh, without commissions, I'm $30 up. Then uh, I entered this break here, so another break. I was waiting for for it to break this one here, and I and I took this one first uh, a target out, and then went uh, all the way up here, uh, and then came back, and I sold uh, the stop and the in this third candle here. So it was uh, um, it was uh, two hundred and fifty dollars. So the second, the, the third one didn't make any 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 uh, any money. I think no, it did uh, make uh, fifty dollars, fifty dollars. So so two hundred, uh, it, it one hundred dollars uh, each plus the five fifty dollars. So two hundred and fifty. Then I took this week out of uh, the uh, out of the thirty four or the eighteen EMA. Um, now with this one. Um, you know, uh, the, there, there's no really good indication here in the, in the, um, in the momentum that, uh, that I was uh, going, that, that it would go uh, positive, but I took it anyways. And, uh, and this one reversed on me right there. So this one was a $300, uh, um, uh, hit right there. So at this point I'm at $20. Uh, loss after being uh, two hundred and eighty dollars up. Okay, next one. Um, move there. Another break out of this one. Move all the way up, and then came back down. And and the first target didn't didn't hit. Then it uh, moved uh, moved another candle and hit the the target but i was out already in this in this one here so this one is zero so just a paid commissions for three contracts now and i i took this week out of the 18 um you know um everything looks uh, good down below here uh, but still this one is a little bit uh, extended um so uh, still um you know, move move three candles to the upside, uh, maybe three and a half, four candles to the upside, to the upside, and then came back, and it it was sold right here at this level, two hundred and forty dollars uh, uh, hit there. Now I am at two hundred and sixty down. And then the last one here was a a. Uh, good trade. Um, so finally, it it broke, and then moved to the first target, and then the runner went all the way up here and uh, and uh, closed and sold at this uh, in this candle here in the second one that uh, that sold. So uh, this one was uh, two hundred dollars uh, for the first one and three hundred dollar three hundred and eighty dollars for the rest of the uh, or or. Uh, or the the third uh, a lot so two lots uh, sold here two hundred dollars plus that that this uh, runner so in between the three trades um, I made three hundred uh, three trades uh, I did actually seven trades um, so in between the seven trades I made uh, uh, three hundred and twenty uh, dollars uh, profit minus commissions now the rest of the day. You know, you have this Darvas here. Um, it was in a range, moving up, down, up, down. You know, you don't take this break because this one is above the cloud, so you're still looking for longs. And then there's a break right here. I did not take. So at eleven o five, eleven o two, that would be another winner. Or this one, even you you could uh, argue that you could take this one as well. Um, but I. You know, I, I did not t take any of those. And then market kept, you know, in the range. There was a, a heavy support here from the prior low. And um, and uh, market kept moving sideways. In the afternoon, you see there's very few candles. There's no movement 
at all uh, in price in the afternoon after uh, after 2 p.m. Um, after one yeah after 2 p.m. maybe 1 and 30 didn't do anything um, after this but um, so we'll see what's going on tomorrow what it's important here is that uh, that uh, what I can you know say about this uh, gold is that this one is a uh, good uh, maybe bullish um, um, bullish uh, pattern right so it uh, with a, with um, maybe resistance somewhere around here 88 18 uh, 21.6 we'll see how it goes tomorrow um, this is not a, a prediction at all because anything could happen right you, you could reverse and come down or or just a move out, out, out of the cloud so this one here uh, it's a congestion area so it seems that uh, there could be tomorrow some um, some um, some congestion meaning meaning that could we could stay stay in this channel until we go through this uh, this uh, cloud maybe to the upside or bounce back uh, below so we'll see thank you for watching